everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atwood. Hey guys, this video is 4K 60 frames a second. No video trickery this time. This is Fight Night Champion finally patched on RPCS3, the PlayStation 3 emulator. You can now play this game at an unlock frame rate, finally. And here's the first gameplay that I'm going to produce for this emulator. This is me as Pernell Whitaker on the greatest of all time level against Manny Pacquiao. Enjoy. Body shot, left hand. Great movement to get away from those punches. Pernell Whitaker with a big uppercut. Pacquiao's able to land a good, solid left hand. Good flush shot upstairs. Pacquiao may get a little return taste of power with his opponent tonight. Oh, Manny Pacquiao's ruined Freeze. with that punch right there. The oh, way. he's hurt right there. He is hurt. Go in this oh, that's got to hurt. Pacquiao goes down. Nice job by his opponent getting into that power shot. One, two, three, four, five. Pacquiao's showing you what he is made of, getting up off the canvas after being knocked down. To the belt line he goes with a left hand. And he's holding. He digs in with a left hand to the body. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Keep your feet moving. Oh, what a whiff by Manny Pacquiao. Good smooth work by Pernell Whitaker. That's classic counterpunching. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, gave him the left shoulder, and then gave him the right hand. There's another left hand from him. Pacquiao steadies the ship here now. Boy, he was hurt, but right now, back to what he's used to being. Yeah, but he better be careful about what he was used to being because that's what got him in trouble, being a little too offensive-minded, getting a little greedy. Blocks that punch. <laughs> Arnell Whitaker's hurt. Wow, is he hurt. He was the one doing the hurt just moments ago. Well, he's been reminded about defense. He didn't want that reminder. It just came in the form of the left hook. That's a, there it is. What a turn of events. What a turnaround. He scores his own knockdown after being knocked down earlier. And that's where scoring a knockdown hurts you sometimes because now you think you're just going to walk in and get it again. Well, he walked in. He did get it. He got it. Good defensive skill. Last 10 seconds. Now these two corners have to do their job after both men went out and gave everything they had. Both fighters getting tagged and hurt by the other. Yeah, well, what you have to do now in the corner, Joe, what you're alluding to is you have to revitalize the fighter. Put some cold water on his head, on his neck, you know, get him ready for the next round and give him some good advice. Tell him how to way, get away from some of those shots. Really wanted that uppercut, but just couldn't get it. Scored well with that straight left. His opponent wanted the body, he wouldn't give it to him. Whitaker's doing a really good job of being defensively sound, of being patient, and waiting for that golden opportunity for some offense to come in the mix. Well, that's exactly what he's doing. He's waiting for a mistake to be made. You know, he wants a lead out of his opponent right now so he can make a miss and bang, come right back with that hook. Headshot lands, was a hook. I like the way he was able to hook to the gut there. a fierce left hand that landed by Pernell Whitaker. Whitaker's combination punching is working well here.
Solid left hand to the head. Good flush shot by Manny Pacquiao. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Good shot to the head with that right hand. Accurate with the straight left. Whitaker with a big uppercut. Comes right back at him with a left. Arnell Whitaker's hurt by a big shot. Oh, he's hurt. He was hurt right there, but now he's grabbing on like it's a life preserver. And he's gonna have to stay there if he's gonna get through these rapids. The final minute of a round that feels like 30 minutes, not three minutes. And this is the kind of fight where you just don't want to have a loser. They're both winners. Solid shot, the overhand left. Whitaker's going with a brand new strategy, and it's pretty simple. That was a left hand that came right. Big, big shot comes crashing home, and he goes down again. Will he get up from this? So the Pac-Man gets himself up to his feet and says, let's go, bring it on. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. 10 clicks of the talk. Whitaker's gathering himself now after scoring a knockdown in that last round. If you were his trainer, what would you be pumping into his head? Well, I would say, you know what? He hasn't recovered. He hasn't had enough time to completely recover. Listen, be responsible defensively. Don't get reckless, but stay on him. Do not let him recover. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Pacquiao's got a big problem right now. We're still in the early goings of this fight, and he's breathing heavy. The only possible saving thing that's still there for him, though, is he does have power. He can pull this out of the fire. Up top with the right hand. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Manny Pacquiao is trying to get back in this round after being knocked down in the last round. But with just 60 seconds between rounds, Teddy, how much can really happen? How much can really benefit a fighter who was knocked down? Well, a lot has to happen. First of all, you hit him with that sponge. Some cold water on top of the head where you revigorate him a little bit. You know, get his senses back a little bit. And you have to talk to him. Once he calms down, once you physically get him back on track, you look to see if he's okay, and then you have to tell him why he got dropped to begin with. Crashes home with a hook. Manny Pacquiao's banged by a left hand. Really good work right there, landing the two punches in sequence by Pernell Whitaker. Pacquiao's gotten through that rough ride right there. I think he's going to be fine. Nice strike after catching one by Manny Pacquiao. Oh, what an uppercut from Whitaker. Great work offensively landing that combination by Manny Pacquiao. Oh, Whitaker with a counter punch. He just missed that shot up top. Cornell Whitaker's in a good rhythm defensively here. Teddy, what is that, a credit to his ability to anticipate? You know, also, it's the teaching. Let's give the trainers credit. Of course, let's give his background of the amateurs credit, but he learns how to get away from punches. This is technique that was taught to him. Manny Pacquiao able to land a huge uppercut. Whitaker's almost looking foolish that time he missed so badly. Good job with the left hand. It was sudden, it was fast, it was direct by Manny Pacquiao. 
And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. Beginning of round number four. Teddy, the way your scorecard reads, he's up three rounds to zip. Good, accurate punching, earning him that lead. Yeah, very conservative. Hasn't wasted anything. But as you just touched on, has made everything count. Pac-Man scores with an uppercut. Pacquiao's getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Must be the punch of the day. Both guys bringing home uppercuts. That was nice. He just drew the punch from his opponent and then a good counter by Pernell Whitaker. Yeah, like running through the rain without getting wet. Beautiful. Pulled the trigger on that overhand left. Pacquiao's making for a tough target there. He gets away from that punch. saw that coming. Pacquiao was knocked down by a punch that came from out of left field. That was like Haley's Comet. You will be seeing that again for about 10 years. One, two, three, four, five. And it's over. Look at this. Arnell Whitaker's opponent is floored. A knockout victory. Boy, was that impressive. P. Pernell Whitaker is able to come up with a knockout victory, and he does it that early in the fight? And does it with one shot that he never saw. Good, enjoyable, entertaining fight it was. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore saying thanks for being with us.